My name is Xavier and welcome. But to the boys are trying to rescue a VIP from that letter van. One, two, three, four, five, six of the boys, that is. Also Florian's here, it would look like. That's a pretty long way to go to rescue the VIP, so we're gonna have to fight this uh, pretty seriously. Uh, there is, I believe, exactly 13 enemies. Oh, hey, there's one! Hey, Muton, I see you! <laughs> That's great. Uh, let's avoid that Muton, because who cares, right? Let's come up here, we'll get near the van, there's always like two pods, we'll fight them, we'll kill them, we'll ambush them or something, then we'll get the guy out and run. We'll fight like half the things on the map, or so the plan is. So let's start out with Florian. Uh, so this mission, what the... Ooh, the heck just happened? Okay, I was actually worried that might happen. So the evac failed to place over here. This happens sometimes. Because it was like, out. Of, yeah, it was outside of the border of the map. Uh, so once it learned it was failed, it then respawned over here. And that's, uh... Interesting, because now I want to do the complete opposite of my previous strategy. Which is to kill these things, one, two, three, four, five out of, I think, 13. Then come kill these things and get the guy out. That uh, sounds good. I bet, however, there's another pod right there. Uh, let's find out right now by tossing the battle scanner up and over. We want to scan around the van. Come on, uh, click. There we go. Uh, surprisingly, no, we don't see anything. Huh. I'd really expected to see another pod there. I bet there's another pod right here then. Who else has a scanner? I think I brought someone with a scanner, right? Is the answer Killjoy? Uh, no. I didn't do my strategy thing, so this is to counter a darker event for something. Uh, alloy padding or some such. I don't care about it too much, it'd be nice to get rid of. But it's not like super important. Uh, so my plan is, we'll take a some risk, but a mitigated risk. Because I also need this squad to go do something right after this. I, and I also forget what that something is. Like I, just, I just basically forget everything all the time. And that's how I play this game, and I'm really good at it. Because, yeah. That makes sense. But here we go. Let's move... Let's see. Max is the best way to activate with trench gun. As far as we know, the pod over here is very strong. It's got five people. One, two, three of them don't have armor. That doesn't matter. Max will kill them all anyway. Let's bring Johnny Maple up. Actually, over here. He doesn't have the best detection range, so let's be very careful with him. I'll move him into the open like there. I want to see what this pod is. Wow. That's one, two, three, four mutons and an archon. That is a frigging pod and a half. That's much more scary than these little doofuses. So why don't we try to set up an ambush against them? Now it looks like they're facing this way, so I guarantee you they're not gonna walk that way. They're probably gonna come over here. So why don't we put Max right here in this location? That'll get him all set up. Oh, he has a steady weapon though. And, but the, the cone on this weapon is so huge. Let's see what the cone is from here. I can almost hit the whole street. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight more tiles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I can hit basically everything if I came to here. Do we have Oscar Mike on Killjoy? I don't think so. I think we have, uh, what is it? A focus? Get some? Something like that. Focus fire? Unfortunately, I wish Max had one more movement to get there, uh, but he doesn't. So instead, we can't put him here or here anywhere. Say, let's put him here. And then we'll steady weapon for next turn. We'll hope those guys come towards us. And then I have no idea what to do. We want to kill everything, right? So why don't we set up to be sort of... God, where are we even going with everyone? I have no idea. Let's move... Run on PMC just closer for no reason. We'll move Henry here. That's a safe place. He won't get spotted. I hope we can activate, like, this turn. We'll move Killjoy over there. Great. Does Run PMC also have a steady uh, weapon? Yes, he does. Good. And uh, Killjoy Overwatch. Uh, Johnny Maple, we need you to move as far back as possible so you can run out and just go crazy uh, next turn. So maybe there. And then finally, Henry, I believe, does not have steady. He does not, so we'll Overwatch. Great. Now we see what they do. Come to me, friends. These guys leave, all five of them. I heard a mech. Is he probably there? Like a pod of three? That's my guess, maybe four. And these guys do move up, as I sort of predicted, but are they close enough? Believe it or not, yes and no. I can hit three of them, but not four of them with the trench gun. And they can move like seven tiles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
They could move like, if they move to this exact tile, which it seems weird because they're going that way, it's possible that we could hit them all. However, if I move over here with Max, and they move, say, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and they were all out there, I could get one, one more tile up, and one, two, three, four tiles over, which would be the whole street, basically. So yeah, I feel like that's the smart move. We're not going to activate this turn. Instead, we're going to move up here with Max. Okay. He sees everything. It's safe. Uh, great. The Street Sweeper can hit everything. That's where I believe they'll be next turn. If not, they'll come over here either way. We'll steady. And then I have no idea what to do with Run PMC. We'll just move him closer so he can run and gun in and trench gun whatever lives, which will probably be nothing. Uh, let's move Florian down here into the street now. I kind of want to look down there and see if we see anything. Uh, of course, we don't, but I heard an Andromedon, not a mech. That's what I heard. We know that's on the playing field now. And Henry doesn't have grapples, so really, what do we do with Henry? Should we get him up on the roof? Can we even get him up on this roof? No. Can we get him up on this roof? Yes. Should we? I don't see why not. Let's do it, Henry, to the roof. And that just leaves Johnny Mabel, who can dash out there and kill everyone. Okay, so we overwatch with him. A Killjoy, I don't know what there is to do with you. Can you command everyone in the squad? Yes, so let's just have you sit here on Overwatch. Now. And the next turn. The next turn, I hope. Uh, Max will have some fun. A little bit laggy, though. Uh, 7 FPS, yep, that's great. Here they go, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 Advent. They're walking away into the fog. Sort of. Yo! Oh, actually, they moved more than I thought they would. So, okay, that's fine. A Killjoy, swing and a miss with a conventional uh, whatever it is. A run PMC was simulate close combat specialist. Hit for 11, it looks like. That's great. These guys weren't an alert, so what are fine. They're going to run around all slow. God, I really did not expect them to move that direction. I guess that's the extra movement. Run PMC, close combat specialist, the numero dos. Hit for 11. Great. Also, we activate all these guys. Wonderful. A fun times for all. Otacon gets mad. This guy goes on Overwatch. What are you doing suppressing? Okay. So we have one Overwatch there, one Overwatch here. We've got to deal with these things. Wow, I might need to actually consider what to do here. I mean, high cover blocks, whatever it is. Uh, street sweeper. So I could actually street sweep all of these guys. Potentially. I don't know. I don't I don't think I have to open the door. That's not cover at all. I could hit all four of them, but then that might activate more. Alternatively, Run PMC is here, and he can hit these two without much fear. Although they'll both be kind of not exposed. Ooh, Run PMC could come here. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And he could trench gun those two. Which is at least a start. Huh. I don't know. I guess moving Henry up here was a bad idea, because now he sees everyone. Henry has by far the best odds to hit uh, this Utterkon. 81%. But do we want to pop Killjoy's focus fire on it? Probably not. What we very likely want to do... Oh wow, I could skull mine that guy and just wipe him off the board like that. But then we might get spotted. We're gonna do lots of shotgun shots. It's very important that they all hit. So let's do this. Let's uh, get some the whole squad with Killjoy's first action. Great. Now, with that up, we're probably gonna command after that, but let's use Henry 82% to hit Archon. Really? That's a 92 with Graze. Swing and a miss. Okay, fine. Let's do it again, Henry. 77% rapid fighter locked on this time. Okay, great. Do it again, though. We need him dead. Okay, and Gray's Grace. Oh, that is fun. Okay, like 15 minutes of thinking later, I've come up with what I, I think is the best strategy here. It's gonna be kind of crazy, but I think... I can't do any better than this, really. So, number one, run PMC. We want to get him in a position to tank. He's got the most armor, the most ablative. He is good. Oh, yeah, also the most hit points. Let's pop Fortify right now. And number two, we want to get him in a place where we can trench gun both of these guys. There's actually only not many places he can do that from. 
I think he can do it from here. Yes, he could uh, hit them. Okay, so that's from here. One, two, three, and then one to the left and up to the right. That should be fine. Let's just make sure. One, two, three. Yep, we're good. Okay. Oh, but the problem is he's going to be flanked here. But there's really nothing we can do about this. We're going to pop... Did we pop running gun yet? We're going to do it right now. We're going to use him to also to pull this overwatch to free up uh, Max. Because Max has to run this suppression, unfortunately. There's really no way around that. And then in terms of, like, where we're going to bring run PMC uh, to pull the overwatch. Well, where he is here, he... Okay, where he is here, nothing. Here, nothing. Here, nothing. Okay, up here, visible, nothing. I come up here, he he would pull the Overwatch in the open here. Very, there's no way to pull it in the cover though. That's extremely unfortunate. All right, let's try to do it this way then. Need to p get this Overwatch pulled with Run BMC with Fortify up. So where we are, he'll pull it here. Actually, he'll pull it here no matter what. So I can't do that, can't do this. Here I could go. Yeah, there's really no way to do this, like, without running run PMC into the open. So you know what? We're just gonna run him into the open then, and then he's gonna have to go pro. He's dashing, and he's got Fortify, so that's a good 20% uh, uh, from Fortify and 40% from dash. A penalty on this guy. And he hits anyway, 42%, and he hits for freaking all the damage. Wow. That's unfortunate. Now, a trench gun. This is a very not good trench gun. We have a 91 over here with an 80. That's good. But this guy, 44, extremely, extremely unlikely. That's okay, though. It's a run PMC. What the? Why camera? Why? A run PMC. What simulate those mutons? Oh, run PMC, though. He kills the one he couldn't even hit. And he doesn't kill the one that he had, like, an insane amount of a chance to hit. That's okay, because this guy will probably, since he's flanked, run away and proc the close combat specialist and die. Great. Next up, we need to pull this suppression with a max. And we're going to do that by running here. Wait, how does suppression work? Is it when you move one tile, it gets taken? I actually don't remember now. Uh, regardless, we're going to try to do it this way. Boom, boom, hopefully we get the cover. If we don't, oh well, not a whole lot we can do about it. And then we're going to end our turn right up here. Hopefully we don't activate, but again, not a whole lot we can do about it. Here comes the Overwatch shot. Oh, we do, we do get into the cover, it looks like. 53% uh, hit regardless, and we did activate more! There's five more. This is just ridiculous. This is so ri this is why oftentimes you don't bother to fight missions like this, you just stealth them. Because what the hell is this? Uh, 15 enemies just like that? Okay. Now Max is standing in the open. He's almost assuredly dead. Uh, but we're going to do this with him. Uh, let's uh, toss out a... Can we hit all four of these guys? Nope. I can only hit... I can. I miss that one. I can hit these three, though. With Street Sweeper. And I feel like I need to do it. We've got to thin out the herd right now. Or, or I could run and gun someplace and hit a lot more of them. Maybe. I mean, there's no more overwatches. Where else could I go to hit more of them, though? Is there any place I could at least go that's safer? Uh, not really, no. Alright, Max, here we go. A street sweep, and let's hope you survive. You might actually die, hitter. Who knows? Quietly. Uh, three doofuses, all dead. Actually, no. There's an M2 Grenadier that did not die. He hit for 39 and 12. What the hell kind of damage spread is that? I'll never know. All right, here's what we do with Johnny Maple. He still does not have frigging Reaper yet. Uh, 140 missions into the game. Good thing I went swords, right? Uh, Johnny Maple, go slice this doofus. 95%, even a graze, he'll die, who cares? And... Okay, he's dead, great. We also get some loot. Elite stock. Why do I keep getting elite stocks and not scopes? I got like 15 elite stocks. Anyway, let's now move Johnny Maple right next to this Muton. The Muton will attack Johnny Maple and he'll Bladestorm and killing the Muton. I hope. That or all hell will ensue and we'll hate everything, but uh, either way, that's what we have to do. We're gonna have to blow concealment here on Florian to give uh, Max some chance of surviving. Uh, so let's move up here. And let's toss out this heater's smoke grenade on top of Max, but only Max in case the Muton decides to try to smash him. Uh, just like that, good. Why did- wait, how- oh yeah, smoke came out here it looks like. And then last but not least, we have Killjoy. Uh, Killjoy is going to command Max. 
uh, to thin out the herd even more than we already have using a rapid fighter. 78% though. Not very good, but also it's Max. Who cares? <laughs> See him, Utah. Oh, he looks so good. That might be the last time we get to look at him, though. This is a lot of stuff. Let's see what happens. All right, snake moves. A snake spits. No, Overwatch. Uh, this guy moves, and then he fires somebody. Nope, he shoots around PMC. 8%. Weird. This guy moves. Quotes Combat Specialist. Or simulates. A good job, around PMC. You shut down the Muton. Hit for 15. Sure. This guy moves over. No good shot. He shoots at Run PMC with Fortify, 32%, Shred hit for 10. Could we get uh, some more 30-40% hits, please? Uh, this Grenadier moves up 11%, shot at max, swing and a miss. This is some kind of commando or some such. 8,000%, this is probably Florian's life. Yep. The Florian's now bleeding out at least. Oh, and I was right about that! Johnny Maple bleached on that Muton! Johnny Maple and Run PMC tag teaming Mutons left and right. So there's a snake, it's an overwatch, here's a guy, he's in, what is he, he's gonna shoot Max with elevation, in the smoke, 21% grace. This guy moves back, uh, come on guys, he shoots at Max, in the smoke, what, he missed? A 6%? That's unbelievable. And now then, we're back to playing the game. Alright, not everything is lost yet, what is an overwatch, we have snake? And we have Snake. I hate Snake. I mean, is there anyone who really likes Snake, though? Anyone? God, Florian, though. <laughs> However, Florian is not dead, at least. Run PMC needs to reload the simulator for free. We know that much. It's possible now that... Okay, so here, it's possible that Run PMC could pull some Overwatches. We did just use... Run and Gun, though. I don't know, I need to think about it for many whiles. Aha! And the plan is formed after 10 more minutes! Here we go! Aid protocol, Killjoy, on run PMC, we need to clear these overwatches first. We're gonna do that with the help of a gremlin defense. And now, run PMC, you're, vis you're visible now to the snake, you're not visible now, you are visible, you'll pull it heater. Great. And now we come straight over. Uh, to this tile, we're in the visible to the other snake with Overwatch. Great, we'll pull that as well, and we'll end right there. Uh, giving a flank shot on this guy. Hopefully run PMC, pull out. Wait, why did we pull zero Overwatches? Why? Why? I don't understand. They Wait, did they not... Uh, did the snakes have, like, fighter control or something? Because that was removed. It might be removed in 1.3, and I don't have that so right now, so... We can regular shot 65% of the Grenadier, or order no other useful things. Run BMC was simulate! Really? Is now the time to be missing 75s so we keep focus. getting hit by 30s and 40s? We just pulled a neither Overwatch. Okay, great. Well, let's do this then. Let's pop a Fortify then with Henry. Uh, we're gonna move over here and hopefully we don't get Overwatches, because we do anyway. I do not understand what just happened, and how how we didn't pull the overwatch running through those dials. But regardless, we didn't. Here we are, 100% on the Viper, or 96 on the Andromedon. The Andromedon has those stupid grenades that could wipe us, but the Vipers are flanky McFlankersons that need to die. So why don't we rapid fire Henry a snake? 83. Great, that's number one. Number two. Fantastic. Hit for a 4 and 11 with a coil gun. That's insane. Okay then. Well, the next step here is apparently we're gonna have to run this Overwatch with Max. Which is really not like my ideal lifetime thing here. Alright, it looks like we do have line of sight on this one here from there and there. Great. Uh, so with that being the case, we can run through these two things out, over, up, and kill the snake, I hope. Or maybe not. Maybe we can't do that. Regardless, we're gonna run and gun with Max anyway. Now then, if I do this and this, can I then get... Yes, I can. I can get all the way over here next to this snake. That's what I want to do more than anything. We'll pull the Overwatch while dashing through the smoke. Or we won't pull it at all until over here. And the Max gets hit for one. 
What is going on with Line of Sight and the snakes? And do they have fighter control? I have no idea. Regardless, a max. 100% to hit snake. 80% to crit snake. A kill it! Great, snake dead. <laughs> yep. For once, that camera actually helps. Elite Hater Trader, okay? That's something new. Now, this gives us line of sight over here, which is fantastic because we can bring Johnny Maple over here. We can stabby stab this Vanguard right in the face. 31% to crit. Also, though, we have Blade Storm to follow up with the next turn, I hope. We also have Lone Wolf right now. Uh, Johnny Maple, please go pro and hit this guy as hard as you've ever hit anything in your entire life and do it right now! Uh, greet him! Originally! Oh, Johnny Maple hit for 17. He's not gonna like that. He's gonna want to... Oh, and he's burning! It's burning 100%? Because if so, that's a crazy. It's crazy. And here's Killjoy. We can't even command anyone because everyone is now out of range. Uh, but we can uh, combat protocol all manner of things, including this uh, heavy grenadier. I don't know why we'd want to do that. I could just pop this guy, but he's gonna burn to death regardless. I should really look up that fusion blade. Is there anything else really to do with Killjoy? We could just move in position now to to, he to rescue Florian, like, next turn. That's probably the smarter thing, and let that, uh, let run PMC with the whatever Overwatch shot uh, deal with that. So we'll move uh, Killjoy up here and get ready to rescue Florian. Good lord. Oh, you burn for six. Uh, bye, Advent, Vanguard. Whatever you are, I had to, like, look at it to see, because I don't know. Here comes something. Run PMC! Is that your threat assessment? Now you get close combat specialists? <laughs> Second time's a charm, run PMC. Holy 11 damage. Now, this guy moves over here. Uh, he shoots. Not a flank on Max. 27%, great. Max is very close to dying here. I really wish I gave him more armor. A trooper moves over. He's gonna shoot at Max. High cover. Max, please don't get hit. Great, 21%. I think they've run out of luck. This guy... What the heck is he doing? He's running in, not to the open, some weird place. He's shooting run PMC with the aid protocol and cover, no good. This guy shoots Max, stationary, swing and a miss. 16%, great. Whew, okay, Florian is still bleeding out. And now then, anyone on Overwatch? One, two, three. No, there is not. Is this everything? Was it, I uh, killed both the snakes? Uh, Andromedon will transform, but otherwise, yes, this is everything on the map. And the strategy is formed! I have been playing this for 39 minutes, I bet it's gonna be like a 15 minute episode, cause good lord, is it all thinking. A Killjoy, let's use action number one, get some the whole squad, very important. Action number two, I actually haven't decided yet on exactly what I want to do with action number two. I think I want to command a run PMC. But will Killjoy, what is, do I want to do it now to get in there, or do I want to... Let's see what the tile says. It's very actually difficult to see the way that I want to see. So where Killjoy is, she can see that square. Okay, uh, so what we're going to do is run, run PMC as far as he can get, which is right here. According to the line of sight indicator, we had line of sight here with Killjoy. While that we're here, let's see what the odds are. A 61% run PMC, or a 48 to stun. Alright, this is what we're going to do then. Uh, let's pop a free reload. Why, why is it not working? All right, click the boot on free reload. Great. Uh, now we're going to use run PMC to simulate a rapid fighter 40, 46. That's horrendous. Don't get a run PMC 46. Okay, nice swing and a miss. Hit some glass. Do it again. This time, did you hit? What the heck? What are you doing with your gun? Why are you swinging it around like a madman? Wow, the simulator can only hit it for two. And that's actually a thing that you just did, okay? Well, let's get lucky then. A Killjoy Command Run PMC. I was uh, hoping for, like, two big hits, and I was also thinking of commanding to finishing it off, but now, really, I either have two more 46s, or I take one chance to 48% stun it, which is probably the smarter chance. A Run PMC, 48%, shut this thing down. Oh, good lord. I should have just, like, commanded him in the beginning, moved up, and then stunned it point blank, but whatever. We didn't kill it, who cares, not a big deal. And now, let's move up here with Henry, actually over here with Henry. We're gonna let that, uh, uh, what is it called, the Run PMC tank the Andromedon one way or another. It's not gonna be pretty, but regardless, it's gonna work. Do we want to 100% this with Henry? I don't think we do. Let's instead pop a free reload, which I have to do from over here. Great, now I have to go back to there for whatever reason, and then pop a rapid fire 96 Henry. 
Okay, you hit him once, great. Good thing I used the free reload and rapid fire. He wouldn't have been dead otherwise. Uh, Johnny Mabel, if you'd be so kind as to dash all the freaking hell the way across the map, an elite trooper, a slice and a dice. A I don't even know what to say. Just that is what we need. Great, is he burning for the first time ever? Yep, he is. And by first time ever, I mean the first time ever he wasn't burning. So he's just basically dead the next turn. But he's not dead this turn, which leaves us one trooper uncontrolled. We now have just the max. A uh, max of per him. We can move over here and we have a line of sight on the Ark or the Andromedon. But the Andromedon has high. That's high cover. Oh. Okay. Well, you know what? Uh, let's do the sensible thing. Always the sensible thing we're gonna do. He doesn't have a free reload, unfortunately, so let's do this with Max. Let's move up and grab the loot. Because <laughs> that's important. Max is just gonna leave Run PMC. Advanced stock, advanced suppressor. Great. I'll leave one Run PMC to his own devices. Let's move now inside here. Grab the other loot, get some cover, and we get suppressor autoloader. Not the best loots in the world. That's the turn. It didn't work out perfectly. I guess I should have commanded Run PMC. But to come up and stun the or, or Muta. What the heck is it? Andromedon. But now it's gonna go flank run PMC. Oh, close combat specialist though, was simulates. And hit for two. What the hell is with the was simulator? Run PMC, do a battle roll! Oh, okay, I guess two can play at this hit for two game. Get it? Two? Two? Oh no, Johnny Maple! Hit for three, but you do have armor grades. Okay, number one. We don't even need to think about this. Uh, Florian's almost dead. Let's do, if we would be so kind, a preview uh, bodies. There's the body. Great. Let's move all the way over here so we have line of sight. Seems doable. And then let's pop stabilize right now. So Florian's no longer dying. And we can be very, very, very powerful. Move Henry up here and just shoot this guy in the head. No problem. Hey friend, uh, greetings from Henry, 95%. What the heck, Henry? Trick shots, uh, trick shots. Okay, he's dead. Well, that certainly wasn't very difficult for Henry. I'm a little annoyed by this thing. We could move up there and just shoot it really hard if we have another free reload, which we don't. I'm not sure that I understand. Like, I reloaded and I used rapid fire. So that should have been one, two, oh, because we used the close combat specialist, I see. How to deal with an uh, Archon, Muton, Andromedon, some kind of on? Answer? Probably Johnny Maple. But if Johnny Maple kills it, I guess it doesn't really make any difference. Let's put him someplace where next turn, for sure, the Andromedon will move and he'll get a Blade Storm. This looks as good as anything. Right there, Johnny Maple slicing a dice 100% right across the map. As the usual, we greet him. Cordially, 12 damage, fantastic. This gives me the confidence that I need to move up here one tile away with Run PMC. On my way. I don't want to be right next to him. I want to be one tile away from him so he punches Johnny Mabel who has hard target to go for Blade Storm, etc. And let's now 100% was simulate his face, 73% quit. We didn't kill him, really? That armor's tough. Got what the? Ammo. We hit for five? How the heck is that even possible? Okay, it's probably better to leave that guy alive on that amount of health, I guess. I don't know. Who knows? Max, reload, no shots. That's too bad. Move up. Okay, you're gonna go after Johnny Maple. Johnny Maple's gonna be like, dude, no, a blade storm. <laughs> and animations will break. Because uh, that's how hard Johnny... Oh, yep, animation's broke, all right. He stands back up. Please tell me Johnny Maple gets a second blade storm. Please, yes, he does! Johnny Maple, you are the best! For the first time ever, blade storm has done something cool, and Johnny Maple does a barrel roll to top it off. Okay, a tag team, you... Oh, dude, can we, can we do something like this? Let me do the old... What was it? UI... Toggle... Visibility... Boom. What... What kind of... Wait. Oh, I didn't, I didn't hit the camera. There we go. What kind of, like, awesome, make awesome screenshots can I make out of this? Why is the, am I getting lines, though? There we go. I'm still getting the lines. I don't want those lines on the screen. Oh, it looks so glorious. If only it was slightly better. Slightly better lined up. Wait, I, I know what to do. 
It's just not quite working out, but I think that's as good as I can get the shot. Look at that duo tag team. It's amazing. A Johnny Maple and Run PMC. I wonder if I could get the other angle, though. Like, what is it like from this angle? Uh, not quite as good, really, but still pretty freaking cool, regardless. All right, enough screwing around with fun times. Let's do the old uh, Johnny Mabel slice and a dice, and he's a pile of rice, uh, just like that. Andromeda on shell, good day. Yep. Uh, kaplak. Inapplacable. Uh, that's interesting. He has implacable, so he has two moves, but he can't flesh. Interesting. Well, regardless, doesn't matter too much. What we need to do here, let's use Killjoy. We're going to now Revival Florian. I guess I could have picked her up, but eh, whatever. And then let's just move everyone. That's everything on the map, so we don't have to worry about all that stuff. When do I get control of some characters here? Let's move Florian all the way up here for no reason. I'll run PMC. You two, come on up. Can we hack that thing now? Nope, Killjoy up. Everyone else up and over. Where's the evac now? It's actually up here. Okay, how do we get up there? Um, I guess we come outside here. So we'll do that with everybody. Including a Johnny Maple who can dash all the way up there, apparently. And even Max. Well, that was one hell of a mess. Everyone's wounded. It's gonna set back my strategy plans. I don't know what they were, but they're set back for sure. However... Oh no, reinforcements. Well, what we need to do now is hack this door with Killjoy. Also, what's the tower? Hypnography. That controls something. I don't know what central command is, but let's do this. Large intel. What the heck? What the? Oh, okay. Sure. We want to go for a rebel in what region are we in? I don't know, or extensive. Let's go extensive. It's like 40 intel still. It's fixed in 1.3, maybe. I don't know. I've reported it like 14 times. It seems to be pretty tricky for some asinine reason. Killjoy, can you hack something else now? Yes, the tower. Central command? What is central command? I don't really know, but what I do know is we need to get out of here. So whenever the game gives me control here... We're gonna start moving probably over this way with Killjoy as far as we can. No problem, boss. Uh, and then I think, do we need to open this door with Henry? Yes. And then Florian uh, can probably dash like all the way up here. Compris, vais. It doesn't hurt at all. Henry, why don't we get you at least some level of elevation? Copy. Uh, run PMC, you probably need to reload. And Johnny Maple, I really don't know. Let's just move up here. You can Overwatch or something like that. VIP G Min Lee up there. And run PMC, I guess, uh, just get on the roof for some reason. Smash! Alright, Overwatch. Overwatch. Hopefully they just drop right on top of us. We'll see. Here they come. Looks like they're landing. I just saw an Overwatch thing, but that was probably me ending the turn. Oh, they're dropping sort of right on top of us. Not really. Oh, hey, Florian. They dropped down there. Oh, if only they dropped on top of Run PMC, though. They'd all be dead, and things would be grand. But they didn't. We're gonna have to fight at least one turn, because Killjoy's kind of stuck down there. That's fine. We got a couple shots. Johnny Maple swinging a miss with a gun. 63%. Fine. Who else wants to have some fun times? Well... And number one, where are these guys, and what are they doing with their lives? Let's see how long Trench Gun is as of right now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten tiles. Uh, so where can I come to hit all of them? Uh, with this guy's heater, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, ten, I think. So probably something like this, maybe? I'm not 100% sure. We'll find out. Who cares? Can we hit them all now with the trench gun? The answer is not almost barely quite. Like one micro tile away. If it wasn't snapping, I think I could do it. Uh, but that's fine. Let's just hit those two because we hate them. Max, a street, a, a sweep. Wow, hit for only nine though. Crit for 20 on this guy though. All right, let's have Johnny Maple go execute the one down there with 18 HP. He's the best candidate to just slice this guy to a pile of rubble. Looks good. See you later, shock trooper, officer, whatever the heck you are. Nobody cares. Uh, certainly not to Johnny Maple, though. Hey, friends. Oh, Johnny Maple. 
What? That's just ridiculous. You know what? We can put Johnny Maple in a tile... Actually, no, we can't. Well, I guess we could if we put him here. This guy would have to either shoot him or move. I don't know. We'll think about it in just a second. I don't think it makes any difference because Henry's here, so... Let's do this. Let's bring Henry downstairs. We'll get him right next to the sentry. Don't care about that. Uh, we'll shoot the other guy, actually, who's not the sentry. There he is, 94% elite trooper, rapid fire, boom, hit number one, hit number two, he's dead, yes, etc. Oh! There's so much for that guy. And now, let's grab... Run PMC. He's a little bit short, actually he could come right here, but eh, who cares, let's grab the run and gun. We run next to him. And we fast forward, because Run PMC is a slow poke. And we Rapid Fighter 92. Greetings, friend! Oh! <laughs> what is this mission? What is this mission? Holy, it's really fun, but this is the sort of mission, like, you can't keep doing missions like this. Uh, you'll not do well when all things that are considered. But yeah. I think we'll be able to get out next turn. Florian, might as well stay here for now, just in case. Let's speed things up. Any more reinforcements? Nope, definitely not. How far can we get everyone? The Max gets up there. Henry gets close enough for next turn. Yep, we're out. Everything's fine. Run PMC, you're up. And Johnny Maple, you sir, are in. Who's this? Alright, G Min Lee. And we may as well evac because we're out. VIP secure and in position for evac. Reinforcements, I'm guessing. They're bringing in reinforcements. Yep, but we don't care. We're out. Problem, boss. Not a problem. Well, we got all the loot anyway, and not everyone is really super hurt. I'm gone. Ready to boogie. But definitely a lot of people. Also, maybe Johnny Maple promotion. We will see. What do I make of this mission? 54 minutes, two seconds to kill 20 enemies. It was crazy. I don't, uh, it was fun, but god, I could not handle doing this every single mission. That was ridiculous. All because the Muton walked eight tiles instead of seven. Uh, and someone did warn me about that happening later in the game, and it just happened. Oh well. Oh, oh well. Twenty-four days for Florian, not bad. She's non-essential, as it were. Only eleven days on Max. That's actually fine. And Run PMC also only eleven days. But Johnny Maple, god damn it! Why don't Canadians ever become Master Sergeants? Is that like not a rank in Canada? God, I want to go look up Canadian military ranks now. Uh, uh, uh. Anyway, whatever. We also got an elite hair trigger, advanced stock, advanced suppressor, suppressor auto loader, elite stock, a lot of elite garbage. 40 intel, that's great. Also, VIP. Who was this VIP? Are they like a staff sergeant? Yes, they are. Let's go see... Well, that means that's at least good because someone can get renamed. G. Min Lee. We have... Ad well, actually, okay health. I think 4 is average, so maybe above average? Or is 5 average? Well, for staff sergeant, it's probably, probably average. 15 mobility is average. 83 will is, like, beyond ridiculous. 72 hacking? Because they're a specialist. 79 aim. Ooh! Why don't we do Overwatch spec for once? I don't know why. It's like a, it's like so much better now in 1.3, but we could try it. That would be kind of weird, right? A cool under pressure, great. A covering fire, no, because covering fire is not an Overwatch thing, in my opinion. We'll grow uh, suppression and we'll go ever vigilant. Great! Alright, all those things considered, we're out of here for now. What the heck was I up to? On the map. There was something I wanted to do, right? It was, was it this? Extract VI, oh that was it, yes. I wanted to do this light moderate extract though. I don't really want to fight an extract. Hey. 
Here's another extract. So many extracts. And it's light moderates and it's strength six. I think I might just straight up pass on that. What's this mission? A nine days hack a workstation. Well, that we can just send like two people to do. Let's see who they could be. Looks like Matthew Rand in two days when he's done flashbanger training. So for now, we'll scan here. We'll see the cha shadow chamber finally, maybe. A hack works again, hack workstation. Hey, wait a minute though. We did deliberation here. This means this is a UFO. This is a UFO for sure. Uh, and what this means is if we can hack this with a two-man squad, then it would be possible to do a UFO, which I think would prevent more uh, avatar pips. I think we have to do that. Ambush troop column, five days, six hours. That's fairly good, but it's strength eight. I think I'll pass given the state of the barracks. We definitely need to do this. Who can we get to do it? it looks like we can get Varnect to hack it. That would be very smart. He's at 166%. It's a very light. It's a hack. That's what he's going to do with Glenn. So we're going to run this immediately. And then after that, I'll send Varnect off with a boost to attempt to solo this ridiculous mission over here. Where was it? The UFO precursor. Then we'll get a UFO, which will be kind of fun. This is going to be kind of hard, though. Moderate, heavy, even boosted. God, they're... It's going to be difficult, but if we can do it, we might be able to stay in the game and prolong the Avatar project just a little bit longer. Uh, so, when's we returning? Varnect is off on a very important mission. He, well, not that important, he just can't get wounded. And this might be a intel or facility lead or something. I don't know, we'll find out when's we returning, for now. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.